So inside of custom fields, what you can also do is add in drop down menus so that uh, what you can do is you can choose from preset of datas as you like. So to do that, I'm going to go around and insert outer column right here. And what I'm going to do is type in, let's say, for example, text right here. And let's say I'm going to go around and choose uh, one text right here, like text two. So this is what I have, as you can see in text two, it's already taken by verification. So let's just go around and change this out. So I'm just going to go around and hide this column, insert another column right here and type in text three. So this is unused and yes, it's unused right here. So let's just go around and then um, uh, add in drop down menus onto this particular field right here. So to do that, I'm going to go around over here under uh, project and under project, you can see custom fields is an option. And over here under task, you can select out text three. And once you do that, you can go around and rename this as well. So let me, let's say, for example, uh, I'm going to go around and say that this is uh, uh, a, a verification or something, or maybe let's say, for example, uh, importance over here. So I'm just going to go around and say importance, for example, over here. And now over here, I'm going to go around and add in a lookup to this. So I'm just going to go around and click on lookup. And in lookup, you can enter out the value right here as you like. For example, you can add in, uh, let's say, for example, very high right here and say high right here or medium right here, low and very low over here, just like this. So once you do that, you can go around and close it out. And what happens is that these uh, information are added in. And if you were to go around and press OK, now what happens is that the lookup data have been added over here in the important section. So if I were to go around, uh, you can see that I can click over here under importance and choose the value as I like right here. So if I were to go around, type in any other value, it doesn't work. But if I were to go around type in medium, you can see it accepts that data. And that is how you can use the lookup values over here and then work around with it um, and enter out the data just like this, as you can see. And that is how you can add in drop down menus in fields uh, inside of Microsoft Project. So I hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.